Stanley. Stella. Are you glad it's Thanksgiving? Huh? Are you happy it's Thanksgiving? Yes, you are. Stella. Stella, are you glad it's Thanksgiving? Mm -hmm. And that's Trudy. One of the dogs I'm sitting for my sister. Trudy the Silly. That's Stanley. And Stella. These are surely the last daisies of the season, I guess, that I picked in the backyard for the centerpiece. For, uh, what have we got so far? I got some rolls, I got some Smart Balance, and some cranberry sauce. No, not the jelly type, the kind with the actual cranberries in it, which I like that kind. And pretty soon the turkey, the um, vegetarian turkey will be ready, and I'll show you a picture of it. Hang in there. It won't be much longer. Look, I'm looking at the screen to the side, still looking to you. I should be looking like this at the camera, but I'm looking at the screen, which makes you I'm a little, it's a little disorienting, isn't it? Or I could look up at your forehead like this. Have you ever had people do that? Look at your hair. Okay, here on my plate before, uh, before I have my actual Thanksgiving dinner are two little goodies that I haven't opened yet. And there are two Christmas CDs that I've bought and I'm trying to follow what I always follow and not listen to Christmas music until after Thanksgiving. But we're going to say sundown Thanksgiving, which will be like 6 o'clock. So here's the two. There's Andrea Bocelli's uh, My Christmas. And let's see, the label says includes the music. Oh, and only at Target it comes with a, two CDs. It's got music videos for White Christmas and Ave Maria. So it looks pretty good. It's got um, duets with Natalie Cole, Mormon, Tabernacle Choir, Mary J. Blige, The Muppets, Reba McIntyre, and Catherine Jenkins. That'll be good. But the other is, of course, the uh, much discussed. Christmas in the Heart by Bob Dylan. So Bob Dylan will be one of those sort of Tom Waits things. If you're all a warm and fuzzy kind of Christmas person, you probably won't like his voice on this. I get from the websites. I haven't heard any of it yet, but I'm a huge Bob Dylan fan. have everything he's ever released. So, you know what? I'm going to like it because I like him. And I like his unique way of doing things. So I'm excited about listening to those. All right, folks, here it goes. Vegetarian Plus, a meatless world, natural, made with non-GMO soy, no cholesterol, all vegetarian, all natural, vegetarian, whole turkey with Himalayan barley rice stuffing, a delicious centerpiece to any festive meal. This four-pound meatless turkey is firm and moist and slices beautifully. Fully cooked, heats and serves in one hour. Includes Him Himalayan barley fried rice stuffing and vegetarian gravy. Serves 10 to 16. And on the back, dig this. A flavor and texture so close to real turkey, you'll look twice to make sure it's really vegetarian. Healthy eating, healthy eating shouldn't mean sacrificing taste or visual appeal. A pleasing presentation is a big part of holiday celebrations, and our bird has a beautiful table appearance as well as a delicately subtle flavor and texture that will have everyone asking for seconds. Made with all natural ingredients and non-GMO soy, it easily heats and serves in just one hour. Once heated, the turkey is firm, moist, and slices wonderfully. To round out the meal, we've included vegetarian mushroom gravy and a side of our delicious Himalayan barley fried rice with vegetarian ham. And that, by the way, was the stuffing. So are you ready to see this? Here it is. Look at that. Beautiful. Let's get an aerial view. Looks like a pastry kind of, doesn't it? I'm so excited. And there's the fake butt of the fake turkey with the dressing on the inside. Look at that. All right. Let's see what else have I got. Rolls, cranberry sauce, vegetarian mushroom gravy, can of yams, and I wanted some stove top stuffing to go with it. So I'm fixing to slice in, dig in. So happy Thanksgiving to you all. And I hope you enjoy your meal as well. Okay, just as a side note, the, the consistency is pretty amazing. I mean, it sort of looks like turkey. I'm looking forward to my first bite. There's where it was sliced. Okay, so let's we'll see how this goes. Bon appetit. Me, huh? You want to get up here and there's really just a food on the table and you're looking at it, aren't you? You're looking for that food. Now I see you looking off.
You're crazy.